Welcome to series 9, tutorial 2, in which we'll be drawing a figure of the prophet Elijah in order to study a figure in a landscape setting. Please keep in mind that in order to follow these composition tutorials, you will need to have completed the tutorials on Drawing the Face, Garment Basics, Drawing the Full Figure Part 1, Drawing Seated Figures, and Drawing Buildings and Landscapes, as these tutorials build on what you've learned in the previous ones. Now regarding the figure of the prophet Elijah we'll be drawing, there are two options. I could either draw the classic icon of the prophet, or use this as an opportunity to explore the composition. I polled my patrons on Patreon, and the vast majority wanted to do a more adventurous composition, so that's what we'll be doing. But let's start off by looking at the classic composition of the prophet Elijah. As you can see, he's centrally placed in the composition. The two mountains create a transverse axis with his body, with his head at the centre of the axis, creating the focal point. His cloak also creates a transverse axis. This arm and his leg move towards the left, as do the rocks and mountains. This is in contrast with his face that is turned and looking towards the right, towards the raven. The arm he's leaning on also emphasizes this movement to the right. I'm going to place his body at an angle. I find the position of the head, his left arm raised towards the raven to receive the bread, Now I'm playing with how I want to make the folds. 